all right what's up guys i'm back with another video a couple things that i've been buying here and there um you know things that i've found um here's the first one it's a jada metals die cast just trucks i really like the trucks that jada does um i've liked them since i was a kid i remember ever since i was a kid you know buying hot wheels i would always look at these and be like these are so cool I wish I could afford to get one of these, but my mom would only give me like one or two Hot Wheels because they're a dollar each. These were like four dollars after tax, so it's like she would never do that for me. So I've been buying a couple of them, and this one just really stood out to me. I mean, the chrome wheels with the blue paint just goes so well. I bought this one at Walmart, and I think at that same Walmart I got this. Um, So I bought this one this year around march 2019 so i know it's a 50th anniversary pack but it wasn't i didn't buy it when they released you know i just bought it now in 2019 i don't know why maybe somebody returned it or maybe they found it i don't know but this was the only one in the whole store the only 50th anniversary hot wheels favorites so this is the only one that i wanted actually so i'm glad that i found this one so i went ahead and picked it up same thing with you know the Silverado, they're both blue and chrome wheels. So that's like a really good combo. Next is the Borla Silver Silverado. Um, I like the Silverado a lot. I like this casting. And I was never, uh, I never seen it in store. So went ahead and bought it on eBay. Um, shop trucks. You guys know this one. I really like this truck. So I went ahead and bought it on eBay has to do it and next we have the uh, custom C3500 Chevy um, part of the nose art uh, here's the rest of the set I'm not sure when it came out I think it was 2013 it says 2011 Mattel I think it was 2013. I was definitely not collecting back then. I barely started 2019, so when I was able to uh, to see and hear about this one, I had to pick it up. Uh, I'm a huge fan of trucks, especially old school Chevys, and especially Dooley's. So this one is like, you know, has the bigger, the bigger back. I don't know how you would call it, the bigger fenders and everything for room for the wheel, for the Dooley's. But um. Yeah, I always wanted this one. And so I went ahead and picked it up. I had to buy it off of eBay too. So yeah. And also the reason I got this one was because it's a premium model instead of the regular one. So when I first started collecting this year, I had never seen a, a metal on metal of this, you know, C, the C3500. And the only one I've seen it was in that five pack, but I didn't want to buy that one because it didn't catch my eye, but I like the truck. I like the silhouette of the truck. I like, you know, this truck period, but I just didn't want to buy that one. And I didn't know they did a metal on metal version until I saw it on a Facebook group. So that's how I figured out that they have made this one. So immediately I went ahead and bought it. Okay, so now I'm gonna open them up. I kind of been waiting to open them up for this video. I just wanted to have it on video. Um, so that's why I haven't opened them yet. But I like to open a lot of my cars. I don't really like to leave stuff packaged. As you can see, I have all this open. So I really don't like to leave stuff in the package for a long time. Uh, but I've been waiting to make a video. So that's why this is still on the package. But I'm about to open all of these up. That's the first one. Okay, I'm gonna go through all these, open them up first, and then I'll show you a better look. Ooh, they almost fell apart.
try to do without cutting myself. Okay, so here you go. They're all out of the packaging. Here's the Datsun. It has very, very good paint. I like the sparkle in it. It has a little details right there. The Datsun, 15th logo, um, tail lights, 15th logo on the other side, Datsun logo on the bottom. It also has paint for the door handles. And then headlights are painted, the grill is painted, and then the stripe going down the middle very good casting and I like the chrome base I love when it's chrome base I don't like painted bases at all just gives it like I don't know more realistic I guess there's an interior you can see a little bit of it I like how the windows are cut out right here I love when they cut out the windows I don't like the whole thing to be window and I don't like when they're um, tinted I like when they're clear so this one's very cool. Next, I'm moving on to the Chevy. You can see the sparkle in that paint. It's very, very nice. These are the kind of things that you really don't get to see in the packaging if you never take it out. Um, so here's that on the on the uh, tailgate bounty. I mean Bonnie, Bonnie Lass. Um, you can see the waves on the side the uh what's it called the crossbones with the skull no details on the front no tail lights either now on the top another again another crossbones with the skull looks like but uh a flag maybe flag design on top and then a woman on the bed with two swords I love that paint, man. It's like a, a deep, deep navy with sparkle in it. It's very cool. And it goes all the way to the front of the truck, too. I like the wheels. Just chrome wheels and a chrome base. Can't beat that. Next is a Silverado. What is it? 2014 Chevy Silverado pickup. I love the 2014 Chevy Silverados. Um, all the way up to the 2018s. I don't like the 2019. I don't like the new ones uh, But I love this model. So I had to pick this one up. It was just a given um, You have silver on the back you have the bow tie Chevy bow tie and then the tail lights You have silver on, on the side You have headlights and the bow tie and the grill painted as well uh, You can see a little bit of the interior and then the wheels. These wheels in chrome are just so nice. So I have to get this one too. I don't like the proportions though. Like, look at that. Like this is not even. Hmm. And then next is the 83 Chevy with the Borla paint. The boiler on the tailgate, you have tail lights, boiler on the side, it has um, Johnson City Ox Oxnard, you know, little things up front, little side marker, headlights, grill painted, and then obviously the red stripes going down and the red stripes on the hood, and with the red interior. Very, very cool little truck. I like the wheels too. and metal base so all of these all of these are basically hit all my checkpoints which is chrome wheels um chrome chrome bases and all trucks well not trucks three trucks and one wagon i don't have a lot of trucks and i don't have wagons so these are great additions to my collection. Thank you guys for watching.
Have a good one.